It's not every day you have a dog and two sheep riding on the back of your truck. They hang out with the dog and they wandered out here to where they're not supposed to be, so now I have to take them back. Hey y'all, we're back out here on a Saturday morning and I had to, of course, be doing some fence work. They, these sheep are just relentless with this green grass on the other side. They're, they'll find little areas that the wire is just up a little bit. So I put uh, two more strands of poly wire, uh, about six inches on the inside of this. So hopefully that'll keep them from getting up here into the yard. We'll see, I don't know. If they, I don't want them to break out anywhere, but if they do, I want them to break out back into the pasture instead of getting completely out. It's kind of frustrating, but we entered into lambing season now. I think we had, had some dead babies. I had to pull one and we had two other ones dead. So that's three dead ones so far, but uh, I think we have maybe six in the last uh, two, two days or so. Uh, that we're alive and so we'll see later on today I'll go walking out through here and see if there's any more that have lambed actually I'm not so sure that one right over there might have some might should go over there and check on her that's a baby that was just born the other day too the white one and it does look like this other one has looks like there's two laying there Yep, she got two little babies there. They were just born since last night. I always remember that mama because she's got a red head. Oh, the red is my favorite color on sheep. She's got a red head. That one over there has twin little black lambs. They were born two days ago, I believe. You like them? Can I go touch them? You go touch them? Mm-hmm. They might run off. Okay, just, just stay here. Well, there's another one that was born last night. She had a single two, it looks like. Dad, and I, I wish more of them would have twins. It's frustrating. Dad, can I go touch them? Those are... A few days older, they might be four or five days old, but got a lot of a lot of babies running around out here. And it's a whole lot more to to lamb. I think we probably have about close to 200 mamas out here that uh, should all be due to start lambing. So we could, if they all have one and a half, that'd be 300 babies out here. That'd be wild. I took my old four-wheeler tires off, front tires. Things are pretty bald, and I had ordered some new tires, and I'm gonna go get them put on today. Well, I got them mounted and put back on. It makes a world of difference. Turns way easier now. <laughs> Should have done that a while ago. Well, I can't die. bull just flipped that bale on its side. <laughs> Ryan, your bull is uh, massive. Here's our newest baby calf, born yesterday, I believe it was. Yesterday or two days ago. Cute little heifer calf out of uh, one of these red, uh, the Herefords. Need 
there's two little black lambs this one and another one we're gonna push them all up in there and catch them caught both of them all right go put them in the trailer got tons of grass up here in this three acre uh, pen and so I'm bringing these two up here this one here she's just had these lambs a couple days ago and she's just a little on the poor side I dewormed her and that one right there has just been kind of having a rough go of it and so I dewormed that thing again didn't look too bad but I'm gonna put them out here on that green grass and see what they do Let him down in there, Aaron. Let him down. Let it down, Carson. Got a pile of posts here. Let's put on the trailer. We pulled them out from around this field over here. Uh, Tristan Plank helped me out with that. That was a huge help. Uh, he pulled most of them out, so. And then we'll get to load them up and haul them off. We got a whole bunch of T posts and two rolls of wire. I'll be ready to build some more fence sometime. Well, that wraps it up for today. Uh, thanks for watching. If you don't mind, Especially if you're new here, uh, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. And we'll be looking forward to seeing a lot more lambs being born here in the next, uh, I don't know, month or so. Uh, it'll be going to seem like a pile of them, that's for sure. We'll see y'all next time.